Hello and welcome to my channel again. This time the topic is how to use REPELS to change state relation. And my example game is uh, the Ottomans. Their religion is Sunni. But I would like to have a Christian religion because then I can expand rapidly towards Europe by building personal unions and uh, also perhaps to be the emperor of the HRA. Um, the basic principle for uh, converting your state religion is to own a province with a target religion and then raise rebels in those provinces and let the rebels uh, convert your country so that the new religion is dominant and then uh, you can enforce their demands. As an Ottomans, there are three possibilities. You can uh, use Orthodox provinces, Coptic provinces, or you can conquer land from Bosnia and uh, then raise rebels there. And um, this time I am I am I want to be Catholic. So my first goal will be to conquer two Bosnian provinces, Hum and uh, Donzi uh, and raise rebels there. Let's see how it goes. Eleven years <coughs> have passed and uh, I have conquered part of Byzantium, not everything, to avoid excessive, aggressive expansion, as I had to also conquer part of Serbia and Bosnia. And uh, I made myself the defender of, of the fate to give me two missionaries, and then I sent those two missionaries into these Catholic provinces. And uh, I lowered the maintenance of the missionaries to the minimum, let's do it, so that they are as ineffective as possible. But still they uh, raise unrest in these provinces. That's, that is the usual procedure that you do with every nation to ignite, ignite those religious uh, rebels. However, Ottomans is a special case because they have an estate called Dhimmi. And they represent the Christian and Jew population in the Ottoman Empire. And you can use them to have very effective and quick rebels. And um, you do the, it by first giving these Catholic uh, provinces into states. And then you give those Catholic uh, Catholic provinces to Timmy estate. Next, you lower the loyalty. I have already done that by using um, race recruit from the Timmy and impose new releases tax. I was able to get it below 40 to 34. And now if you revoke a province from them, they will immediately revolt using releases sealers uh, which can convert your whole country into their their religion. So and now we have to wait one year because before we can revoke those two provinces from Dimni. Let's do that. One year has passed again and now you can revoke those two um, provinces from Dimni. And let's do it. The first one and as you can see there is a revolt already. They have risen up and let's do the second one also now. Like that. Nice. You, now you have um, two rebels and they are Catholic shields. And um, what they will do now, they will siege down provinces and every, every time they siege the province, it will be con also converted to Catholic 
uh, believe. What you have to do also is to take care that the other uh, rebels do not rise using harsh treatment. And the other thing you'll have to be very careful about is uh, that um, you don't let the rebels to break country. So your goal is to have them converting uh, the provinces so that is, it is the uh, dominant religion. And you can see it by going to lecture and taking uh, the economic and cards lecture. And here you can see which religion is dominant. So at the moment we have 47% Orthodox and the same amount of Sunni. So these two are dominant at, at this time. And uh, you'll have to wait the Catholic religion to be the dominant one. And uh, if they occupy, they have seats more than 50% of the country, uh, the, you don't succeed. So you'll have to take care that um, you will unseat the provinces if it's going to break. So let's see how it goes. So the first provinces are sieged and um, I will probably have to move my army away. Uh, another thing is that at the moment uh, Ottomans are in war and during the war time it is not possible um, to break, break the country. But you have to be very careful if the war ends so that they won't have over 50% of the provinces sit down. Now they will wait a while and then they will continue to the next provinces like that and start sieging. And um, as you can see, these provinces are right now orthodox, but as they seize them down, they will convert to Catholic, like that. And now the only thing is to wait and see the provinces converted. Uh, and let's wait a while. About three years have passed and uh, the rebels have been converting provinces to Catholic and um, there are a couple of things that you should be aware of. First, before uh, starting the, the rebels you should mothball all your forts so that they can seize them down quicklier. And also uh, you should set your subject nations to passive so that they don't kill the rebels and also if possible uh, have not allies because they might kill your rebels too. So at the moment uh, the Catholic is already the dominant religion, it is also the largest one. So now we can go to the um, stability and expansion tab and uh, handle the Catholic Church rebels. Now, if we accept the, their demands, so as you can see, Catholic becomes the new state relations of Ottomans. Like this. And if we go to the, the religion tab, we can see that uh, the Ottomans are now Catholic. Thank you for visiting my channel again. And welcome back. Bye.